so today's to today's topic is brachial plexus it is found by the ventral primary nerve of c5 6 7 c8 and t1 c5 and c6 will join together c7 will be remain single c8 and t1 also will join so these are the roots here we are dividing some area these rough lines you have to make first you have the roots trunks then division codes then the branches so upper two root join to form the upper trunk upper trunk middle trunk and lower two will join to form the lower trunk then these trunks will divide into two division anterior and the posterior division you have the three anterior and three posterior division so this is the anterior division this is the posterior division of the middle trunk and the lower trunk also anterior division and the posterior division different colors you can use this division will form the cords all posterior together they will form the posterior cord most middle side will have the medial cord lateral cord continues as the musculocutaneous nerve and medial cord continues the ulnar nerve and lateral and medial root join to form the median nerve posterior cord will give two branches axillary and the radial from the c5 your dorsal scapular nerve upper trunk now to subclavius and suprascapular nerve c5 c6 c7 join to form the long thoracic nerve from the lateral cord lateral pectoral nerve branches from the medial cord medial pectoral nerve median cutaneous nerve of arm median cutaneous nerve of forearm from the posterior cord three branches upper subscapular lower subscapular and the thoracodorsal nerve 